Hello and welcome to this week's episode of Around the Mountain. This week we are joined by EOU men's basketball players Jordan May and Kobe Gardea for an interview and a game of shock or tell while covering some more exciting EOU winter sports action. Women's basketball continued its winning streak now at 22 games in a row after wins at Northwest and Evergreen. The Eagles gave EOU its toughest game of the season on Friday with the Mounties needing two overtimes to defeat Northwest 94 to 91. My Ayudias broke the school record with 45 points in the game, also posting a career high of 17 rebounds. Unsurprisingly, Ayudias was named both CCC and NAIA Player of the Week with two great games. Men's basketball went one and one on the road and remained in fourth place in the CCC with an eight and six conference record. The Mountaineers are home this weekend for the final home games of the regular season. On Friday, they host Warner Pacific for Play for K Breast Cancer Awareness Night. On Saturday, EOU hosts Senior Night, where the women's team will honor seniors Ayu Diaz, Marin Harrod, Khadija Newmeyer, and Julia Henney, while the men will honor Peter Eke and Saeed Hersey. Paige Dodd broke another EOU record in the women's 60-meter hurdles in a time of 9.18 seconds for a provisional mark. Justin Gold won his second CCC Athlete of the Week award in the pole vault, reaching 4.95 meters. He has the second best mark in the NAI this season. The women's 4x400 meter relay team of Megan Bolton, Katie Emerson, Michelle Herbs, and Elizabeth Herbs hit a B mark of 3 minutes 59.67 seconds. Men's wrestling defeated Southern Oregon 21-18 to bring home the wagon wheel to conclude the regular season. Senior Harley DeLulo came through with a big victory in the second to last match, defeating the number four ranked wrestler at 197 pounds in overtime to secure the victory for the Mountaineers. The men are next at the second annual CCC Championships on February 15th and 16th in Great Falls, Montana. Women's wrestling is on their way to Atlanta, Georgia for the WCWA National Championships, which are gonna begin this Friday. Good luck to them. Next, we'll talk with men's basketball players Jordan May and Kobe Gardea as they get set for their final home regular season games. I feel like like this team, we're very connected like on the court and off the court. We like hang out when you're not on the court and you just have your time. And it's like kind of like a brother. And that's, that's really cool actually. Yeah, translates onto the court too. Yeah. That's why we keep getting better. If you can't tell, we're getting better. <laughs> We want to finish in fourth or higher for sure so we can get that home conference tournament game. But the higher we finish, the more home games we get. So that's kind of what we're thinking. I'd be a leopard or a cheetah. I was going to say that. Yeah. Something with spots and fast. Or a shark. I hate sharks. But sharks are scary, bro. The ocean's scary. What kind of shark? <laughs> All right. Any shark. Bro. Any shark. Great white. Any shark. Steph. LeBron. My favorite's OIT, just because they always are like going really fast and the mm -hmm. games get a little chippy, gets a little fun. Yeah. Uh, I'd say either OIT, Northwest Christian, or Corbin. Mm -hmm. Those have been two good games for us. Mm -hmm. Fun ones. Yeah, yeah. for sure. Very fast. And very fast. Yeah. yeah, lots of points. Hilarious people. <laughs> yeah. yeah, we're going to miss them yeah. on the court and off the court. Now we play our game of shock or tell with the guys. In this game, each guy will get a hidden question that they must answer out loud. Then they must choose whether to reveal the question or they get shocked. Um, I would go to Victoria's Secret. It says if you wake up as a girl, what is the first thing you would do? <laughs> <laughs> That's what I would do. <laughs> it's terrible. Um, Jordan May. I didn't read the question. <laughs> Track and field. The question is, if you could play another sport, what would it be and why? I would play it because it's just running. <laughs> it's easy to train for. I hate running. <laughs> right? <laughs> I'd probably say Mike or Ian. And the question is, who is your favorite EOU staff member? Uh, uh, Coach Kemp, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> um, track and field. Ooh, 
Let's get hard. Uh, I missed a dunk in a game. It says, what is the craziest thing you've done in college? Jarrett Schetzel. And it says, who is the funniest player on the men's basketball team? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, this is a bad one. Um, um, Answer. <laughs> I don't want to. Um, okay, I'll say uh, Tiffany, the assistant women's basketball coach. <laughs> okay. That's it for this week's episode of the show. Next week, we'll be joined by a couple of men's wrestlers as they head to the CCC Championships. Be sure to like and share this video on all social media platforms, and we'll see you next time.